I have to do what? All you have to do is wear the fur so Silvio thinks it's yours. I'm not wearing the fur. Well, then Newman and I, we get thrown out of the building. Is that right? <laughs> All right. Why don't you just take a good, hard look at what your life will be like if I'm not around? <laughs> Newman, too. Oh, come on, man. <laughs> well, I'll tell you what. If you do this, I'll give you that Walkman you're always asking about. That's my Walkman. And you'll get it back. <laughs> All right. All right, good. Thanks. I owe you one. Hey. hey. Oh, hey, and by the way, uh, that Walkman was broke when you gave it to me. <laughs> George, did you get that chair yet? Can't see when it gets you. Would you stop riding me? You know what? Just call up and cancel it. I'm out. Excuse me? Joe Mayer doesn't like my taste in music. He's not getting a gift from me. Oh, I can't believe you're dropping out, too. So now Kramer and I have to pay for the entire gift. Oh, now who's this Joe Mayo everyone's talking about? <laughs> He's the guy we're buying the chair for, remember? It was your suggestion. I think the chair is a fantastic gift idea, but I never heard of this Joe Mayo. Frankly, it sounds made up. <laughs> oh, so now I have to buy the whole chair by myself? No, you don't have to buy anything. I already bought it. I've been lying to you for three days, and now you're all screwing me. <laughs> I don't understand. Why didn't you tell us you had it? I needed it. My back is a little tweaked. Because of your giant wallet. Just get rid of it. Never. It is a part of me. I will just return the chair, and it will be easy because the receipt is in my good friend. Your good friend is morbidly obese. <laughs> well, at least I'm not carrying a purse. It's not a purse. It's European. <laughs> All right. Silvio's down there. He's shoveling the walk. Now, all you got to do is put this on. You go down to the corner, you pick up a paper, and you come right back. All right. There you go. How do I look? Odd. <laughs>